Well, both parties are divided. Bernie Sanders got 47 percent of the vote against Hillary Clinton, and Donald Trump got 44 percent of the vote against a field of 16. Both parties are going through a period of disruption. There's populism that's popped up in America, as it has in the 19, late 1920s and 30s, and as it did in the 1880s and 1890s. We're having another burst of populism, and it's roiling both political parties. Think about it. An obscure backbencher from Vermont takes on the former first lady, former secretary of state, former two-term senator from New York, and gets beaten 53-47, and raises almost as much money as she does and never holds a single fundraiser. And on the Republican side, eight former past or, or current governors, five past or current United States senators, uh, you know, a Fortune 50 CEO, a accomplished brain surgeon, and Donald J. Trump. And who wins it? Donald J. Trump, but again with 47 percent of the vote. And again, po uh, populism had a great deal to do with why he won. There are a lot of people who don't really agree with the specifics of what he says, but they know what direction he wants to go in, and they want a guy who pick up a brick and throw it through the plate glass window and is completely unconventional. And that's him.